Hey, how's it going? It's Sam Frost here. And in today's video, I wanna give a plug for a podcast episode I recently appeared on. So I recently appeared on a podcast called Marketing for Business. It's run by a guy, Scott Wilson, who is here in the same city as me, Christchurch, New Zealand. I've known Scott for quite a long time. He's been prominent in the digital marketing space, where I live at least for a number of years now. And this podcast of his, Marketing for Business, it's one of the most popular marketing podcasts in New Zealand, listened to by a lot of people. And it's not just applicable to New Zealand though, if you're listening from Australia, UK, USA, wherever, the advice, the information in the podcast is still gonna be really good. Uh, and he's had some really interesting guests on over the years. And Scott recently asked me to come and record an episode with him. And in this episode, about an hour long, there's a lot of content in there. We're talking through a whole load of different things that primarily apply to sort of B2B organizations trying to be successful with digital marketing. But I also talk through the story of how I got into digital marketing in the first place how I sort of moved from affiliate marketing to doing in-house work to client work. But more importantly, there's a lot of kind of learning and insight around common pitfalls that I find business owners make with digital marketing, particularly in the B2B space. Things like investing heavily in creative projects or new websites because it's something that you can control the output of versus actually going out and trying to sell to customers. Things like focusing way too much on sort of last touch digital attribution, track to things like Google Analytics rather than talking to your customers and understanding where their perception is of where they actually found out about your business, because that's often the most important thing to try and influence that kind of initial touch point. So go and check out the link in the video description. You can watch the video version, you can listen on your favorite podcast uh, or audio app, and basically it's well worth putting aside an hour in my view. Obviously I'm a bit biased, but it's a good episode, and you might also like checking out some of the episodes of the Marketing for Business podcast as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy the podcast. Check the link in the video description below and I'll see you for the next video here.